Hello YouTube, uh, welcome to my Juggernaut tutorial video. It's uh, since the war is starting in 11 hours and there might be a few of you guys who want quick influence and fast Juggernaut build. Uh, I found a one that works pretty nicely. Uh, it's, I think at the moment it's pretty popular. Uh, here it is. Uh, it's a uh, plasma cannon and five focus build. Um, I think it's like one of the fastest builds out there. It usually takes me around seven rounds. So for my cores, on my primary I have um, critical heal and lifeline. Uh, well, both these cost varium, so if you don't have any varium, then uh, I guess don't worry about it. It's not really that important. I'm using the Dages Haunted Boomstick. Uh, it's uh, helpful in hitting multiple enemies. Uh, classic armor, I have the Eternal Enhance, improves all my stats, which is a big bonus. And uh, health booster, in case I need that extra health, which usually I don't. And for my auxiliary, I'm using the Azrael's Artillery E. It also hits multiple targets, so that helps. And for my robot, I'm using the Dark, uh, dark Botanical Bark. Um, if you haven't noticed, all of these are energy variants since that usually does the most damage against opponents and most of my weapons are uh, designed to damage more than one opponent so it makes the matches a lot faster uh, here you go, this is the build once again and here are the stats um, legendary rank, that's up to you but since I have everything already I don't have to worry about it uh, So. Here's a quick demonstration of how you guys um, play out a whole match. Alright, so um, typically you want to start out with the gun. Since it has a two, uh, two turn cooldown, you can easily spam it pretty e um, often. And then you follow it up with, uh, with the robot. And then you go for your auxiliary. And here's the important part. Um, you see it would make sense to attack Exile Soldier with my Plasma Cannon and kill him. But the better option is to go for Frost Demon. Because your other weapons are already going to take care of him anyways. And since they have heals, um, it's not really efficient to try to kill him since he's going to heal anyways. Typically it takes me around 7 rounds, but this one might take 8, we'll see. No, oh, it's gonna take 7. But yeah, um, that's the build. That's how you use it. Uh, so, here's a compilation of me playing games.
So, alright, I think you guys get the point. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, think it's helpful, uh, leave a like, subscribe to the channel maybe, and see ya.